Chameleons are known for their color-changing ways. The males show how strong and beautiful they are with the brightest colors and for thermal regulation. But who knew they could glow? Well, it turns out, no one, until now. When we found the glowing light, we were really excited because it was a really new discovery. It was the first time that anyone saw fluorescence in chameleons. For David Protzel, a self-professed chameleophile, it all started with an inkling. We saw a photograph on the internet of scorpions and spiders under UV light to show their fluorescence. But he also had one photograph of a chameleon and we saw three blue spots uh, behind the eye. And then we were wondering if this might be fluorescence as well. David started looking at his own collection of preserved specimens under UV light. Let's check it out. Wow, it's glowing, it's blue. Mark, have a look. Oh, wow. Does it do that on the other parts of the body? No, it's only here in the head region. Okay, we have to test this in all of the other chameleons. Yeah, let's go. We were very surprised because fluorescence so far is basically only known for marine organisms and scorpions. But among reptiles, this is the first example of fluorescence. And it's so widespread, all species or the majority of species of chameleons show this phenomenon. The next question is how do they do it? Now I'm preparing our specimen for a micro CT scan. I will fix the tube here in our micro CT scanner. And inside the micro CT, the specimen will move around slowly and we get X-ray images from every degree. Here we got a 3D model of our chameleon. So the question was, where does the fluorescence come from? What's the origin of the fluorescence? If I change the threshold here, we can see the bone. And these bony tubercles here are exactly the tubercles that we saw in the blue light before. So the fluorescence actually comes from, from the bone. The proteins, pigments, and other materials in the bones are what make them glow. Kind of like how our teeth glow under a black light. Now to solve the final mystery. How does the glow from the skull shine through? The skin above the fluorescent tubercles is very thin and works like a window. The bone can shine through the epidermis and is visible from the outside. For David, this incredible discovery brings up even more questions, like why do chameleons glow? Yeah, we are not sure yet. We think it may work as a signal to conspecifics or to other chameleons in addition to the color language. Because usually chameleons communicate by color change and this would be a constant signal for species recognition. We think it's a private signal from chameleon to chameleon but not visible for predators. So it might help them to recognize their own species and to find mates.